What happens if you were the last person on Earth? In the ethereal realm of what happens if, where the whispers of the unknown beckon, let us contemplate a scenario that transcends the boundaries of imagination. What if you were the solitary sentinel, the last vestige of humanity upon the Earth's desolate stage? Picture yourself awakening to a world shrouded in eerie silence, where the remnants of civilization stand as silent witnesses to the enigma of your existence. As you traverse the empty streets, the weight of solitude presses upon your shoulders like a heavy cloak, a constant reminder of the solitude that now defines your existence. Yet amidst the desolation, there is a strange allure, a sense of liberation that comes with being the sole inhabitant of a world untouched by human hands. But beware, for this newfound freedom is not without its perils. The remnants of civilization, once bustling with life, now stand as silent sentinels of humanity's folly. Abandoned vehicles litter the streets, their rusted frames bearing witness to the passage of time. Crumbling buildings loom like specters in the mist, their shattered windows offering glimpses into a world long forgotten. And yet, amidst the ruins, there is a strange beauty, a sense of peace that comes with the absence of mankind's incessant clamor. The wind whispers through the empty alleyways, carrying with it the echoes of a bygone era. The sun sets in a blaze of crimson and gold, casting long shadows across the deserted landscape. But as night falls, so too does the veil of solitude grow ever darker. In the silence of the night, the mind plays tricks, conjuring phantoms from the depths of imagination. Shadows dance upon the walls, their shifting forms a testament to the fragility of sanity in a world devoid of human contact. And what of sustenance in this barren wasteland? In the absence of human intervention, nature reclaims its dominion, swallowing whole the remnants of civilization in a tide of green. Yet amidst the ruins, there are whispers of sustenance, a bounty of canned goods and preserved foods hidden away in forgotten pantries. But beware, for time is not your ally. With each passing day, the stores of food dwindle, their expiration dates a constant reminder of the ephemeral nature of existence. And so, you are forced to turn to the land itself, to hunt and forage amidst the ruins of a world long past. Yet even as you struggle to survive, there is a nagging sense of unease, a feeling that you are not alone in this desolate world. Shadows flit at the edge of your vision, and strange noises echo through the empty streets. Is it merely your imagination, or is there something more sinister lurking in the shadows? As you navigate the desolate landscape, you are haunted by the ghosts of the past, memories of a world that once was, and dreams of a future that may never be. Yet amidst the solitude and despair, there is a glimmer of hope, a spark of resilience that refuses to be extinguished. And so you press on, a solitary figure in a world devoid of life, driven by the primal instinct to survive against all odds. For in the end, it is not the solitude that defines you, but the strength of your spirit, the indomitable will to persevere in the face of adversity. And as you stand upon the precipice of oblivion, gazing out across the empty expanse of the world, you realize that perhaps, in this desolate landscape, you have found something truly remarkable, the essence of what it means to be human. We can see the importance of connection and communication in human life. Despite existing in a world full of freedom and limitlessness, 
loneliness and the absence of human relationships make life more difficult and longing. The social nature of humans, the need for communication, sharing, and interaction not only help us overcome physical challenges, but also enhance our spirits and create necessary support in daily life. Furthermore, we must cherish our knowledge and self-learning skills. In such solitude, knowledge of survival, farming, hunting, and water treatment becomes extremely important. Self-learning and adaptability will be the deciding factors between survival and demise. Finally, the story also serves as a warning about the lack of conservation and protection of the environment. The removal of humans can increase the risk of environmental issues, such as biodiversity loss and environmental pollution. This underscores the importance of protecting and respecting the natural environment to preserve life on this planet. That's all the information that we have for you today. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed today's episode, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the bell so you never miss out on future episodes. And be sure to also tell us what you think about today's content. Everyone's support motivates us to continue delivering quality content and to always improve. As always, thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.